in this video we're going to try and find values of a values of a here for which this whole thing here will converge so so for example suppose a is 3 will this thing converge or will it diverge suppose uh, suppose a is 0 0.2 will this thing here converge or will it diverge or when a is or when a is negative 4 will this thing here converge or will it diverge so in this video we're going to try and find values of a that will allow this whole thing here to converge okay so so our normal routine so ultimately we want to find this but our normal routine will our normal routine has always been to integrate it from zero to, to an arbitrary point B and then allow B to head towards infinity. So we would evaluate it from zero to B and then later on allow B to head towards infinity. So integrate this, that will then give you this. Put this into here, that will then give you this. And then put zero and then put zero into, into the X. Zero times A, it will be zero. And then E to the power of zero will be one one times this thing will just be that thing. So once you get to this stage here, then you can answer the question of um, what of the what values of a will allow this thing to converge. Once you get to this stage here, you can answer that question. So hang on. If you um if you look at this here, um so suppose uh, suppose a is one, then you're gonna have a graph of e uh, suppose a is one, so e to the one x will look something like e to the x will look something like this. Will look will look like this, and then e to the e to the two x will look something like this. E to the three x will look something like this, and then as as b heads towards infinity, as b heads towards infinity, you can see that this thing is just going to grow and grow. This thing here is just going to grow and grow and grow. This thing here is just going to grow and grow and grow. So when a is greater than than zero, it's just going to grow and grow and grow. But then if, if you look at A, when A is negative, when, when A is negative, it will look something like this. Even if, even if it's e to the power of negative 0.2, uh, the, the, the minute you have a negative, it's, it's going to go in the other direction. It's going to go, it's going to go in the other direction. Now as B heads towards infinity, as B heads towards, towards infinity, this thing here is just going to head towards zero. It's going to disappear, leaving just this thing here, leaving just this thing here. So, so to answer the question here, um, the, well, this will converge when a is less than uh, is less than zero. So, so, so when this thing here is less than zero, it will converge. Okay.